What is good peeps, HMK here once again, and we finally got a taste, and I want to be able to note that this is not the full opening of Kingdom Hearts 3, it's just a taste from the Kingdom Hearts 3 opening trailer, and it's been a great trailer, I personally dig the theme of face your fears, or face my fears, whatever between Utada Hikaru and Skrillex, and I do have an analysis video on the way, however I do want to focus on one specific area in the trailer that a lot of people have been talking about on Twitter and it's been bothering me quite a bit and that is the advent, the theory, the thought of Xehanort's true eye color. The reason why I bring this up because in the Face My Fears trailer of the opening of Kingdom Hearts 3, we see young Xehanort with what appears to be silver eyes which is a definite far shot away from his natural and iconic yellow golden eyes because in the series thanks to Nomura and everything we've seen in Kingdom Hearts Xehanort's yellow golden eyes are very iconic in the series in which those that are connected or influenced to him have those yellow eyes and it's such a big deal that everyone that's been norted in Kingdom Hearts 3 shared that feature and according to what we knew from the series and Nomura those iconic features are trade mark of Xehanort. But now in this opening we see Xehanort, young Xehanort with silverish grayish eyes which is definitely not in line from what we've known before. This so called revelation is spreading like wildfire to the point where many people are believing that this may be Xehanort's true eye color and from what we know in the series if that's the case then it could mean a huge development in which case that people are thinking that Xehanort all this time could have been possessed himself by another entity who is the true puppet master of Xehanor and the entirety of the Kingdom Hearts series. And honestly, if that is the case or anywhere near it, I don't think I'll like that because I enjoy Xehanort's character. I want Xehanort to be that character and for him to be puppeteered by another would take away from that, all that buildup over the years. However, there is a bunch of pointers that I want to put into perspective before, you know, resigning to the supposed fate. Now obviously the first is that way before young Xehanort even left Destiny Islands in order to be a Keyblade wielder over at Land of Departure, Hire had yellow eyes, his signature yellow eyes as shown in Dream Drop Distance. Also, in the various instances, because young Xehanort is here playing on the chessboard with the chess pieces like we've seen before in 2015 and 2018, and in both of those instances, young Xehanort had his yellow eyes. And then of course in this trailer we do see yellow eyes being shared by the various incarnations of Xehanort including Ansem, Xemnas, and Master Xehanort himself. So this has me thinking a couple of things. One, it could be purely aesthetic to show Xehanort being enamored by the darkness for the first time in his youth way back when when he was a fledgling Keyblade wielder. As the room is very dark lit and he seems to have a fixation on what I've come to dub as the dark star off in the distance which glows in his eyes. Of a striking purple light. This can be purely symbolic just for the opening showing that darkness is growing in this man that has come to court it. Another thought is that it could be a lighting issue because if you were to take these eyes and then put purple inside of yellow it, I don't think it'll look as good as if his eyes were gray or silver and then could do that in order to you know help convey that message of him looking at the purple star. And once again, it could be symbolic just for the opening for him coming to terms with the role that he will take on as Xehanort. And lastly, it can easily be a visual error because we've seen this before in the 0.2 opening when it comes to Ventus Vanitas where his eye color was supposed to be yellow and he had that weird mouth guard left over from the helmet of Vanitas. That was the wonky stuff in the trailer version of the opening of 0.2 but in the actual in-game 0.2 opening they changed it in order to make sure it reflected what was shown in the past games and what was actually real. So with that in perspective, I honestly think that uh, Xehanort's silver eyes in this opening could be a number of things where it could be a visual error or some sort of symbolic value added to the opening. If it comes to the case where that is truly his true eye colors and the fact that he got possessed himself, I don't know if I'm going to be totally down for that. Kingdom Hearts is going to have to do some wild stuff in order for me to be on board with something like that. Because honestly, I like Xehanort's character. I like his status as a villain. I don't want uh, Disney or Square to take that away from him, saying that he was possessed this whole time. I really dug that character about him, and I don't want them to take that away from him. So guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below about Xehanort's eye color in the opening, and if this is his true eye color or not, or it's a number of things that could have some sort of deeper explanation or some sort of error. Leave your comments in the comment section below and don't forget to like, share, favorite, and most importantly subscribe to HMK. And if you want to take it a step further, check out my Patreon and sponsor me here on YouTube. Until the next video, I've been HMK and I'll check you guys later.
So you haven't subscribed to HMK yet. Don't piss Xemnas off.